morning everyone today is june 30th and i have my economics final exam today it's around 8 30 in the morning i've already eaten and i'm right now finishing up some smoothie and drinking some water with lemonade and i am doing some last minute studying for my exam today i have math class before my exam which kind of stinks because i really would just want to get the exam over with but you know beggars can't be choosers so i'm just really really happy that this is the end of my summer class journey <music> So I just finished my math class and I'm getting ready to go downstairs and get a little snack and then get changed out of my pajamas and then do some more last minute studying before my econ exam. It is currently 11.10 and my econ exam starts at 11.45. So I'm just really excited to just take this exam and just get it off my mind and then start studying for my math exam, which is tomorrow. So I got a snack, put my hair up in a ponytail because I like my hair out of my face and yeah doing some last minute studying just really gearing up to take this exam I changed my outfit too wearing a Baylor school prom t-shirt that I got from high school and I'm just hoping I can rock this exam out because I need it I need to get great I finished my economics exam probably about three hours ago the reason I didn't film three hours ago was because we had a huge thunderstorm and the lighting was awful but I made an A on it which is super duper exciting so I hope I can use the confidence I just gained from getting a good grade on that exam to help me study and want to do well on my math exam. So I'm studying for math right now and I kind of realized that I didn't even really tell you guys like what my econ class was all about. So basically the econ I was taking was microeconomics and the number at UT is econ 211. So basically I learned all about monopolies, perfect competition, monopolistic competition, oligopolies, game theory, um, just the demand curve, supply curve, marginal revenue, marginal cost, average total cost, all of that fun stuff. But currently I am doing math homework. I am in math 123, which is finite math. These are all my notes that I've taken over this month, which is like so much. And I'm having to do a final exam review. I have to do a review for every single unit and and my final exam is every single unit. So it's definitely going to take me a little bit to do this review, but it's going to be really, really helpful for me to like look over my notes and just kind of bring back stuff in my brain that I've kind of blocked out over these past couple of weeks. This is what I've gotten done so far. Um, but I definitely have a lot more to go as you can tell. Before doing studying, I'm going to eat a little Sana, AKA dinner, and I'm going to be eating chicken salad that my mom made for me with some townhouse crackers. morning everyone today is july 1st that's crazy to say so it's a new day today is my math final exam i'm just kind of ready to take this and kind of like i said yesterday just like put all this behind me so i can just have the month of july to really relax and enjoy my summer break currently right now i am just looking over all my notes just making sure i have every lesson i need and just really looking over the notes because it is an open note exam which i'm so grateful for because there's no way I'd be able to remember to do all this stuff without my notes but just really you know looking through it and making sure I know where everything is in case I need to go through my notes and look up something to help me solve the problems in my exam so I just finished my math exam and that was definitely the most rushed I have felt on an exam this entire month which is not good I answered everything but I didn't have enough time to go back and check my work which really worries me because I always feel like I have a careless mistake and there are some things that I wasn't really confident in that I don't really think I got the correct answer but I knew what I was doing I just may have made some careless errors I really wish I could go back and check on but I didn't have enough time so I'm very very nervous to find out what I'm going to get on this final exam but at the end of the day I know I did my best throughout this whole month and so I just have to be happy with that. 
it's just a really great life lesson to realize that sometimes you may work really, really hard for something or you may want something super duper bad. And sometimes it doesn't work out the way you think it should because, you know, of your effort, you think you deserve more, but you know, that's just how it is in life. You're not gonna get everything you want. And I worked really hard, but I'm just gonna have to accept what I get on this exam. And whatever grid I get is not going to make me feel any less of myself. Obviously I'm gonna be disappointed, but you know, I know that I'm a good student and I know that I work really hard and I worked really hard and that's that that's all I can say you just have to be positive about it so that's a wrap for summer school which like I said before I'm so happy and grateful to be done and just have that chapter closed in my life and just really enjoy my summer vacation I will see you guys in another video very soon bye